and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. Today, I'm gonna be going over what you need to be doing in Madden right now. Now, this doesn't just this doesn't just apply to today. This applies to tomorrow specifically and the rest of this week. So I want to do this now because typically when I do these the day of, I don't post these till about like 3, 4, 5 p.m. ish Eastern time. So for most people who have work, school, social lives, family, whatever, by the time I post that video, it might be a little too late to get you guys ahead of the game. So I like to give you guys this video one day early, maybe another time this week. But I'm going to keep you guys up to date with what's going to be coming out this week and what you should be focusing on and keying in on this week as a Madden Ultimate Team player. So I have a few things in regards from a lot of Mud Hero stuff, some coin stuff. I'll be getting into all that later in the video, guys. But before we get into this video, I want to thank you guys for all the crazy support as of late. You guys have been killing it. All the views, all the likes and everything. You guys have been crazy. Thank you guys for helping grow this family. The Poodle Gang, the Poodle Family, whatever we start calling ourselves, guys. You guys have been killing it. Once we hit 10K, that is a huge milestone, boys. We could say that we're making it at that point. So thank you guys. We're 500 subscribers away. So everyone who's new to this channel right now, you won't regret it. Smash that subscribe button. Come join the family. Turn on that Noti bell, boys. If you're part of the Noti gang, you're right here in the heart, boys. So join the Noti gang. Make sure to go down below. Comment down below any feedback you have in this video. Anything you think I missed, guys. I love the feedback. Every bit of feedback you guys give me helps me improve as a YouTuber every single day. And if you guys haven't already, give this video a big thumbs up, boys. Let's get this video to 200 likes. That'd be greatly appreciated. Now let's get into this video. So guys, first things first, what's we doing in Madden right now? So you guys know Mutt Heroes did release last Friday. So approximately like what, four days ago, three days ago. So that means we're just starting the promo. And if you guys didn't already know, Mutt Heroes is a segmented promo. So we got 16 players out of the 32 on Friday and we'll be getting the other 16 this week. So we're probably getting some players. I don't know if it's today, but I know we definitely for sure get some Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. That's 12 players. I don't know if the final four, I don't know if the, the four start releasing today or so what on, you know what I'm talking about? Like what? The rest come out on i have a pretty good feeling they come out today and the rest come out wednesday thursday friday so pretty much the other half of mud heroes will be going over this week so you guys want to be staying in, in touch with prices what will be coming out and also we do have the free players coming out so the first thing you want to be doing before we get into mud heroes boys is make sure you're getting this challenge done by the time you see this video it might be too late but i'm just gonna get it out there so you guys know future reference the madden ultimate team 10 solo challenge the rob gronkowski solo guys if you don't know already we already i think we're up to about week six of the mud 10 promo so if you guys haven't already, you want to play the solo challenge as quickly as possible. Get your one star so you could be done with it. What does that say? You were too close to the expiration time. Wow. So if you didn't do it already, you're kind of screwed, guys. You want to be getting these done, though, because every time you get one of these tokens, you do indeed get one step closer to getting your free Fantasy Nat limited time Mutt 10 Legend pack. So at the end of week 10, you will be getting that. So make sure you guys are staying on top of that. I unfortunately did screw up and missed one week thinking that I had, because I bought the Michael Vick power up. So I thought I got him already, but I didn't realize that I bought him. I didn't get him from a solo. My mistake there, kind of really frustrating, but it is what it is. Not much I can do about that at this point. It is, it is really upsetting though. But guys, for the most part, you guys want to be staying on top of the Madden 10. Also, don't forget that Team of the Week does drop tomorrow. So make sure you get the solo challenge done. As if you still have it, get it done. I already got mine done. Get your tokens because at the end of the year, just like Mutt 10, you will be getting a free fantasy pack for a Team of the Year player. Which, when it comes out, these cards go for like upwards of 500k. You want to be on top of that. Now, next on the list of things you want to be doing. Guys, tomorrow, house rules should be dropping. If anything for that we got from the Mutt stream is that they will be releasing a new house rules with a free Mutt Heroes player. Most likely not. I believe it's confirmed that. So, if you guys come over to the set list, you guys are going to stop you thinking about what you guys want to be getting from this pack. Tomorrow, I will be releasing a ranking video. If they do release the house rules, I will be dropping a ranking video for you guys going over the top players you want to be taking from the Mutt Heroes promo. So, as of now, we got nine defense and we got seven Oh, uh, no, yeah, 9 defense, 7 defense. That leaves us with approximately 16. So we should be getting 4 more today. And if what I heard is correct, you can still get the unreleased players from those packs. So, in essence, like Saquon Barkley doesn't release till Wednesday, you could potentially still get him a day early. You could get Ramsey a few days early. So remember that it should include all of them. So as of now, you guys want to start be looking at these players, anyone you want. For me personally, from the offense, the only guys I'd want from this list is about probably David DeCastro. And from defense, is probably... That's nothing. I don't really want anything from these defensive players. So for me personally, I will be mostly keying on the new releases of the Mud Hero players. So I will be making a ranking video for you guys going over the top 10. Now, you guys are probably wondering why not the top 32. It's pretty simple, right? 
why would I give you guys the 32 through 10 rankings if most likely if I have guys in the top 10 they're so far and away the better ones I think in every nap pack that's fantasy there's always a few, like three to five guys that are solid like you need those cards those are the cards you need from the promo everyone else is like subjective you might want them you might not like mitch morris you might want him lamarcus joiner you might want him because you have a theme team but i'm gonna be going over the guys that you need to take like these are the guys that are beasts like saquon and jalen ramsey the ones that are like a must-have from this promo so i'll be giving you guys about five to ten players that you need to have from this promo that you should be taking out of those packs that are kind of interchangeable i'll go over the ones that are like home run hitters that you need to be taking and then i'll give i'll give you guys all that so you can go over that for your solo challenge pack and your house rules pack it all comes it all depends on if they drop it tomorrow i believe they should because they do house rules every two weeks and we did not get one last week so i'm assuming now is the time that we'll be getting one now for you guys like i said i will be dropping the ranking video so stay tuned for that turn on the noti bell so you guys are ready for that now you also want to be on top of your solo challenges so as you guys know the solo challenges right here i hope that they extend them today but i'll go over what i mean with that in one second as i get there so for the mutt hero solo challenges there are currently 70 available stars you can get the featured tier as you guys see on the middle middle of the screen is the nat hero fantasy pack so that does confirm that we should be getting two nat hero fantasy packs what that means is that a nat hero fantasy pack means that we could pick one hero from any mutt hero that they release now for this one i know that we can pick from any hero what I'm hoping is that they don't do this for house rules is that they make it so it's like a fantasy pack where you get three options like offense and defense or something or just three random options that could potentially screw over who you end up taking. So I guess that will remain to be seen when it comes out. But for the most part, I know this first one is out of 32. You can pick anyone. So for that one, like I said, I'll probably be taking Saquon because he is going to be on my team. So I might as well save the points on that. So again, if they're both out of 32 players, you can pretty much take anyone, which is where my rankings will apply. I currently have the all um, my top 10 rankings out. But those are just top 10 of the players that are really like i've seen so far when the new players are released and i see full stats and back of the card stats i'll go over like the top five you need and then the extra guns that are like interchangeable but you guys want to be getting these done now so the reason for that is because let's say today it is monday at 10 30 they do have the updated content for the week so i'm hoping that maybe they give us the rest of the solo sequence um solo sequences at that time which would then mean we could get the fantasy pack today i don't know if they'll do that they might actually just wait till like wednesday thursday or friday to do that so that we don't get back-to-back -back fantasy packs from the house rules today and then tomorrow maybe they'll wait till later in the week but if they do do it today guys that's why i'd recommend you start getting on these solos now because if they don't release it today if they do release it thursday the worst thing you could do is get to thursday with only like two hours after work to play and you have 140 stars to get that you probably can't get i'd imagine the solo sequence takes between two and three hours to get done not the longest solo grind that you've ever seen but again for me personally i'd rather get these done now the, i'm gonna get the 70 done probably today or tomorrow if they don't release it today so that come thursday or friday whatever they do end up releasing if it's not today i can just go in real quick finish my last few stars and be done with it and be done because the last thing you want to do is save them all for once and then you have house rules to do you have weekend league coming you have your solo battles you have all this you're gonna get overwhelming i just get a lot of this done on like mondays when there's not no content is a great day to do a lot of this stuff like no gameplay type content stuff to grind for so get your 70 done as soon as possible so that when they release the rest of the 140 you can go ahead and finish it within an hour and a half without actually having to grind three hours straight i'll probably get this done as soon as possible so those two fantasy packs are huge because for me personally i think there's only like two to four players that you really want from this promo so for me and for most people as a coin tip i wouldn't invest too many coins into mud heroes yet i'd wait for your packs get your fantasy packs construct your team excuse me when you see what you guys can do with your team like for me to give you guys some insight i'll probably take saquon and jalen ramsey so when i toss saquon to the offense i feel like my offense is going to be set for a while and then i'll probably end up selling back mitch morris and greg olson and then from there i'll wait for most feared because the last thing you want to do is invest all your coins into mud heroes considering most feared is right around the corner i'd rather wait for one of the first big promos such as most feared so i don't i don't recommend spending millions of coins on mud heroes i recommend you take your fantasy packs which is why i do like this promo is because they did give us the opportunity to get two for free so i could take my saquon i could take my ramsey set my team and then wait for most feared and then for most feared i can really go all in on coins such as if i get an aaron donald a kamara or any of those type of cards that i really do enjoy so i wouldn't recommend you guys go spend all your coins on the wednesday thursday and friday releases of mud heroes like i said get your fantasy packs first and then also wait because prices are only coming down get your fantasy packs first and come this saturday when they drop fantasy packs and the mark comes down a little bit that is when i'll start going in depth on like i'll go make videos for you guys should you guys invest in any other players or just to keep them you know what i mean personally save your coins really gauge what you need don't just buy because you want to buy players money i think most of you is going to be a way better promo and with way better cards better overalls 
Mud Heroes only gave us 91, so you have to understand that 91s are kind of like the the overall norm right now in Madden that we already have released. You want those next tier cards. You want the 93s, 94s, the cards that like stand out of the pack. These cards don't really stand out. Like Saquon and Jalen will stand out, but that's about it for me. I obviously have to go over this in depth when the ranking stuff comes out. But again, you don't want to go splurge on cards that are no higher overalls than the cards we currently have. That is why take your two free, wait for most feared, save your coins, because those cards will go for similar prices at the time, and then you can get those next level tier cards. You always want to be progressing your team forward, not making it better at the median. If you guys don't know what that means, it means like you have like 10 of these cards, why buy five more of the same overall? Wait, save those coins, because then in two weeks, three weeks from most feared here, you can get cards at a higher overall that starts progressing your overall forward. Right now, adding Mud Hero cards is like this as your team. Add most of your cards like this. That, that's like the trajectory that you'll be going on, guys. But that is about it for what you should be doing in Madden right now, boys. I will be making an updated what to do with your coins in one of these few days when all the Mud Heroes drops and the Nap Packs drop and some market stuff changes. But that is about it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, come join the Poodle Gang, the Poodle Family. Hit the subscribe button. You won't regret it. Turn on that noti bell, boys. Let's get to 10K as quickly as possible. Comment down below any feedback you guys have for the video and anything you guys think I could do better. And make sure to drop a big like on the video, boys. If you made it this far and you're a loyal supporter or you're new, hit that like button, boys. Get the video to 200 likes. That's all. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. Stay tuned for all the rest of the videos I will be dropping today. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. See you guys in the next video. Peace.